The jailed Kurdish leader Abdullah Ocalan has reportedly outlined a peace plan with Turkey. If it happens, it could end three decades of conflict between Turkey and Kurdish rebel fighters. Under the plan, PKK fighters would begin a ceasefire on March 21st. They'd then start withdrawing from Turkish territory with a goal of pulling out entirely by August the 15th. Ocalan has been negotiating with the Turkish government since December. The plan will need a broad commitment uh, by Turkey to improve the rights of minority Kurds. While well, Cenk Zey Akhtar is a columnist for the Today's Zaman newspaper, he says the proposal will benefit Kurds across the region. Well, I mean, it's, re it's uh, genuinely historic. I think it's a historic development and uh, none of the parties would have won this war, uh, which is almost 30 years old. I don't know who intervened to unlock the this stalemate, this deadlock, probably the U.S., but uh, uh, we, they are talking to each other. The entire rhetoric has changed and Turkey is just rejoicing to see the, uh, finally a peace in the, in, the, in the horizon. I mean, Turkey has never uh, resolved any conflict by itself so far. It's the first time that it's going uh, through a conflict resolution process. I think we should be uh, patient and, uh, and forward looking. It's definitely a win-win situation for the both parties, but not only. I think it will be a win situation for northern Iraq and as well as northern Syria, where there is some Kurdish population, as you know. I think it's, a, it's an overall positive development. This is why I, I called it historic.